Welcome. I'm new into there. And this is Takata. This is the second episode of Repton 3. And as you can see around here, some things have changed. Gone are the solid walls, and we've got fences now. Some nice little green fences, and what seem like red chain link, possibly. Now, I'm not going to explain every single trap from now on because I'm sure you can appreciate some of the places where you can get stuff. So, I'm only really going to point out some of the more interesting parts of the levels. Around here we've got lots of fungus which you have to let out but it's not going to cause us any troubles because we're going straight into the transporter. And this first level doesn't give us much apart from what's that up there? It's a green speckled egg. I don't know guys, I think I'm a bit scared. I might just leave it. I oh, know I can't leave it. I have to kill all the monsters on the level. I'm gonna have to face it. I don't know if I can do this, guys. It looks like it's gonna be horrible. I mean, green spots. I mean, it's contagious or something. It's gonna be oozing or or something horrible. Uh, oh, oh, let's. Oh god, let's see what's inside. Okay, I can't do this. What the heck? Some fat-eared rat thing? Just die. Rat-eared bat monsters. The last ones were scarier, come on. Oh well. They still follow the exact same pattern as the other monsters. Now, at the start of this level, we get a choice. Which transporter do we want to take? Well, it doesn't matter. One of them leads us right back into this area after we've done a little puzzle. And all the levels link together, so if we miss it, it's not a big problem. We can see some fungus up there, but it's all fenced in. It's obviously just to make the place look prettier. The monsters have some weird ideas about interior design. Now we've got to make sure we keep that little bit of dirt down there, otherwise we're trapped and we can't get out of here. We go up here and we see... Oh, a cage. Right. So we're going the other way then. As we can see when we go down here, they throw a lot of keys at you, which do nothing after you've collected the first one. Let's follow this little diamond path. Where will it lead us to? Oh, a nice little floating cage puzzle. This one's a bit more difficult than the last one we've seen, though not too much at the moment. But it does give us this monster to figure out what we sh are going to do with it. What should we do, guys? Yeah, we'll do it that way. Get ri rid of the bat-eared thing. Put it out of its miserable existence. And here, we get to do a lot of waiting. For the spirits to come around and turn these cages into diamonds. That's one. So, uh. Oh, hey, look! It's, uh, it's, a, it's a bird on top of a rock or something like that. Isn't that nice? Yeah, <laughs> how about that? Oh, hello, finally. 
It's not like I had anything better to be doing. There's certainly not a time bomb around here about to go off or anything like that, so take your time. And here we go, into the bird's mouth. Last one for now, screen C, Octagon. Right. Now this level, I got to play this first part quite a lot. So I've streamlined the diamond collecting by the point I actually managed to get a good recording of this. And because this part here is not very complicated at all, I decided to liven things up a bit. Oh no, I'm being chased by spirit. Oh ho, phew, I got out of the way. Now I get to chase them. Ha 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 ha. Oh no, they're chasing after me again. Whatever can I do? Oh, I'm just out the way here. Wow. You've got to make your own entertainment at times, haven't you, really? I mean, when they throw simple things at you like this. And this is why I had to repeat the level over. This guy, and one of his brothers. Not the one you saw up on top of the uh, fence there. One a little bit later on in the level. He was a pain to deal with. Dealing with both of them in one single run, without making a mistake. Well, it's a bit tricky, I can tell you. So here he is. Now, come over here, Mr. Monster. We've got a nice little rock down here which we can drop on your head. Come, come here, Mr. Monster, I've got a rock! Ha ha! The rest of the level doesn't present too much of a problem to us. There we go. See you in the next video.